Hey guys, welcome to my channel. As Christmas is soon approaching, I bring you a Christmas special series on my channel which will be called Food Must. The first recipe on the Food Must series is chocolate plum cake. If you are hosting a Christmas party, you can prepare this cake a day in advance so that you can be relaxed on the day of the party. Let us look into the recipe. To begin with, we need to soak some dry fruits in orange juice. So here I have taken 1 tablespoon of sweetened cherries chopped, 2 tablespoon of prunes chopped, 2 tablespoons of sweetened plums chopped, 1 tablespoon of tutti frutti and 1 tablespoon of black raisins. You can change the quantity of dry fruits as per your liking. Take all these dry fruits in a bowl and to this add 1 fourth cup of orange juice. Mix the dry fruits with orange juice and leave it for at least 2 hours. Now for the dry ingredients, in a bowl, sift 2 cups of all-purpose flour or maida. Sifting make sure that there are no lumps in the flour. Now add 1 teaspoon of baking powder and half a teaspoon of baking soda. Next add 1 fourth cup of cocoa powder and sift this as well. Mix all the dry ingredients together and keep it aside. In another large bowl, add 1.5 cups of powdered sugar. In this, add 1 cup of butter which is at room temperature. With the help of a whisk, mix the butter and sugar together till it forms a cream like texture. Next add 3 eggs into this butter sugar mixture. Mix it well till there are no lumps and you get a smooth mixture. Now we will add half portion of the dry ingredients into the wet ingredients. Mix it till the flour gets combined. Now add the remaining portion of dry ingredients and mix it well. Add half cup of curd to activate the baking soda and 3 fourth cup of milk to adjust the consistency of the cake mixture. Add milk little at a time to make sure that the mixture doesn't become too liquidy. Remember to add curd after adding the dry ingredients else the egg butter mixture may split. Mix everything together well so that there are no lumps and the batter is smooth. Now add the dry fruit soaking in orange juice. Combine this with the cake batter and you have the batter ready. Here I have taken a cake tin and lined it with butter paper and applied some butter on top. If you don't have butter paper then apply butter to the container and dust some all purpose flour on top. Add the cake batter into the container until it is 3 fourths filled. Smooth out the top layer, tap and shake the container to release any air bubbles. This will go in the oven at 200 degrees for 30 minutes or until the cake is done. After about 30 minutes, the cake has become brown on top. Now let's check if the cake is cooked on the inside. And yes, the stick has come out clean. Now let the cake cool down completely. Now to take out the cake after it is cooled down, loosen the edges with the help of a knife. Then turn over the container on a plate and gently tap it. Take out the container. Slowly remove the butter paper on top. Here you have chocolate plum cake ready. 
Let me cut and show you the texture on the inside. The cake has risen nicely and is soft. Eggless chocolate cake recipe is already up on my channel. Click on the info card or check link in the description box. If you like the recipe, do try it at home this Christmas and share the video with family and friends. Subscribe to my channel if you haven't already and click on the bell icon to be notified about the new videos. Thank you for watching.